Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back, people. So right now we have on the planet. Dog, you know, he's here. You know what I'm saying? So he's his it's like a draft. So, you know, it's a blessing to be the top learning thoughts, motherfucker so in America. In America. You so do. you have to, yeah, so you have to pay your money. Let you listen. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you enjoy the video. You know, it's DJ Brookshot. Like, subscribe. You know, do what you do. What else we got going? What else we gonna do? So yeah, we it's drugs for selling. Look how much money we gonna make off drugs, man. Just weed alone, how much money it made. Just imagine how much money we gonna make off drugs, man. People gonna do drugs regardless. We gonna have drugs control. We gonna have drugs control. We gonna have it controlled. Sell, sold in the stores. We're going to get all the money. No more Mexico. Uh, no more uh, none of that. Nobody else. We're getting all the money. How rich we going to be so fast off of selling drugs? Legally. So, yeah. That's what I. That's the plan to get us back rich, right? But if you can't handle your drugs, you out of there, kid. We're going we gonna to put your ass in that rehab. We're going to put your ass in that rehab. So a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, they just need to be monitored. A lot of rich people do them crazy-ass drugs y'all be talking about. Every rich white person, Mexican, even black now does cocaine. Cocaine is like the ingredient for crack and everything. So most rich people do cocaine. All kind of races now. It's over. Like That shit is like, if you don't know, yeah, all them cool rich motherfuckers you think, they on cocaine like a motherfucker. All them up. Even the youngsters, everybody do cocaine now. You get a bad bitch today, she gonna say, "You." I be like, you wanna hit the weed? No, do you have some coke? <laughs> this is life, kid. This is life. I learned to let people do whatever drug they wanna do peacefully. I like weed. Y'all pick whatever drug y'all wanna do. Some people, cause if you give a motherfucker who do cocaine weed, they not gonna, you don't want them on that on a new drug around you. That's not cool. That's when they start tripping. Be like, nah, boo. What the fuck is wrong with you? You know what I'm saying? I tell them, hey man, you get whatever drug you want to do and you do that. I like weed. But I'm not here to make you try no new drugs. You know what I'm saying? That's when people start tripping out. Let them do whatever they want to do. I let people do whatever. Don't pass out at my shit or nothing like that, but. Yeah, man, I don't judge nobody. Meth is crazy, but we probably is gonna have to legalize it just to keep it in order, just to know who on meth. We're gonna get their name. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna like, this nigga, he'll be meth out. We gotta keep a good eye on this nigga, make sure you ain't breaking in nobody's cars and then all these cameras. So we good. It's gonna be even better right now. You don't know who the meth head is. You know what I'm saying? If the nigga gotta come keep getting his meth prescription, at least we can keep an eye on the nigga like, ah, right, we in this area see some crime popping up. Let's check the mid head nigga highs first. <laughs> Let's check. Y'all ain't thinking like me. You know what I'm saying? You got to think smarter, man. You got to think smarter, man. <laughs> oh, yeah, we going up, kid. We going up, man. Exactly, we gonna figure all this shit out. Reparations, man. Um, um, how can we do that? In a, black people do deserve something. We got, we built this motherfucker as slaves. The white people got a head start. We do deserve something. I don't want nobody to be in 2024 waiting for that shit. Like, oh, they need to give us. Come on, man. Them people ain't gonna give us shit. So I don't, I don't say that because I don't want nobody to get excited to be waiting for no shit from nobody. But if I'm the president, we gonna figure this shit out. Black people don't gotta pay taxes. Fuck it. Black people don't gotta pay taxes for sure. If we can't get everybody free on taxes, at least black people don't gotta pay taxes. We were slaves. If you was born in America, you do not have to pay taxes. Straight up like that. At least give a nigga a pass like the motherfucking army. You know what I'm saying? Like a motherfucker in the military. That motherfucker won't even do that. God damn. 
that's fair, right? You see what I'm saying? I ain't wanna just go like, you know what I'm saying? We don't need no, yeah, fuck with me. We don't gotta pay, to, but a lot of black people go like, fuck you, Slim. I get, I look forward to my income tax check. They gonna be like, fuck yeah, I want my income tax check. Nah, kid, we ain't gonna get them in out. They ain't gonna take it from the check at all. We good. Right. Bet. No items, no clothes. Black people shouldn't have to pay no taxes forever. If you was born in America, a black man, black woman, you should never have to pay taxes. Y'all ain't gonna give a nigga no motherfucking reparations. Fuck it. Give us that. You know what I'm saying? Give us that. At least that's fair, like, you know what I'm saying? Is y'all vote for me or what? Is y'all vote for me or what? Because I'm coming, I'm coming up with some dope shit, man. It's 420, it's 420, it's 420, it's 420. It was 420 on the live. But yeah. Indians out, so I'm sorry, my bad, I apologize. Indians out, so. Indians, no taxes. Exactly. Indians and black people, no taxes. Okay. America, you finally fixed this big ass motherfucking uh, bullshit y'all had on us for all these years. Y'all fucked our life up. We've been complaining. Y'all ain't give us no reparations. None of that. So fuck that. Now, no taxes for Indians and black people. All races should agree to that. Nobody had to be slaves but black people in America. So we should be, if you was born in America and you black, you should not have to pay taxes or Indian, straight up like that. Now, is that fixing it? Is that making shit work? Brown folks, y'all wasn't no slaves. Y'all y'all from Mexico, y'all wasn't no slaves. Y'all wasn't no slaves. We was the slaves. So we can't just let y'all slide like that, kid. We welcome you into America, you know what I'm saying? We ain't tripping. But at the same time, the Indians and the blacks is who got to get the no taxes. Can we all agree on this? Can we send this shit to uh, the U.S. government and get this bill, this bill started for my campaign? Can we get started on this? You know what I'm saying? We already took child support off for y'all, kid. Like, so, baby, women ain't just having, women ain't just having babies for uh. You know what I'm saying? For random money, you know what I'm saying? We took money out of marriage, that way women ain't have to get married to men and divorcing them just for money, you know what I'm saying? We making real love come back and that's what the campaign is. Let's get back to realness. Let's start doing shit because we really want to be with each other, not because a motherfucker rich. If a person can't benefit from people, then there will be a different type of love out here. You know what I'm saying? it will be a different type of love out here. You feel me? Fuck with me, man. I got a lot of great ideas. All we need y'all to do is donate. All y'all, if you believe in the words I'm saying, you like what my campaign stand on, just donate. Send me whatever, a hundred dollars, hundred thousand, million dollars, 10 million. I heard Elon giving his boy 45 million. That'll be more than enough. We'll get a lot done with that. Send me 45 million a month. I do more than enough with that shit. I go get some suits right now. You know what I'm saying? I get me some suits chopped up right now. You know what I'm saying? We put it out. And this is what I do. What does America look like? Does America look like me? Tattooed. You know what I'm saying? Not perfect. Not perfect. You know? Yeah, I got flaws. Yeah, I say some crazy shit sometimes. But I'm real. And that's what America needs, man. America needs somebody real. Who's realer than Big Slim? Slim Thug for president, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's go, man. Let's go. Let's go. Jail will be a real rehabilitation um, place. It won't be just a place to hold motherfuckers. Uh, you know, people who do outlandish crimes will be locked up, but, you know, uh, people who do crimes like drug selling and shit, nah, we ain't gonna hold them too long. We just gonna get them back out there and get them a job. They gonna, I mean, teach them how to run a business. You don't have to sell bricks. If you was able to do that, look what you can sell. You know what I'm saying? We gonna redirect the energy. 
That way, we create more millionaires and making our country better. Instead of trying to lock people up and take people down, we're going to build everybody up where everybody is up. You know what I'm saying? What else we, we got fucked up we got to fix out here? What else we got to fuck up? We fucked up that we got to fix. Uh, let's rewrite history. Nah, we're going to keep it real. We're going to say what happened. And that's what that is. We're going to say what happened. And that's what that is. Yeah. Uh, we gonna legalize polygamy. Cause why the fuck you can't do whatever the fuck you wanna do in your bedroom? We not gonna hate on gay people. We gonna let gay people do what they wanna do. You know what I'm saying? We gonna. But you can't tell us we can't have threesomes with girls and have polygamous relationships. Cause that don't make sense. You know what I'm saying? So, that's what that is. Vote for Big Slim. 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 What else we need to do, fellas? Because I'm riding for the men. What else we doing, fellas? I'm riding for the men. They've been fucking over us for a long time. Boy, the women get their weight, don't they? What else we gonna do? Shit. Boy, that, that marriage taking that alimony and shit out where women can't benefit in their child support, that's gonna make motherfuckers. You ain't gonna even need to wear, uh, take birth control. Motherfuckers is not gonna be wilding and fucking like they would. They're gonna be like, oh no, I can't play like that. Yo, uh, you ain't got your money together, sir. I can't be. Yeah. But yeah. So we gonna get it together fast. Ain't no such thing as if he ain't paying no money, he can't see his son. If he broke, that's what it is. You shouldn't have had a baby with him. You let him see his son. Let him spend time with his kids. Yep. It don't matter that you don't like his new gal and she got a BBL and look fine. It don't matter. Nope. Let him see his child. Ain't got nothing to do with that. Yep. What else we gonna fix? That's some European idea shit. They don't even under, people so slow they don't even realize that. That's white people shit having one wife and cheating and giving it away, you know, somebody everything for cheating. What the fuck type of scam shit is that? In Africa, you kings, you can have as many as you want, kid. You how much money you got, you can afford? Yeah, that's what we doing. It wouldn't even be that many baby mamas. Now watch how much shit I'm finna fix. By having, poly, by legalizing polygamy, it's going to be way less baby mamas. It ain't going to be no baby mamas. It ain't going to be no baby mamas. It's going to be polygamy. It's going to be dudes with more than one family. He got more than one house. One house over here. One... Everybody good, though. Yeah. They done white folks done tricked us to start thinking like them. They ain't really trick us. We just fell for it and let, the, let them put them rules on us. We ain't. That's, that's not no... Uh, uh, BBC energy. That's not no big black clock, big big black cock energy. Talk about some one. What are you talking about, kid? You got to give up everything if you get caught cheating. Man, we from Africa, kid. We can have thirty wives if we want thirty wives if we can afford it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all brought us over here with this old lame ass roof. What else we change when I run for president? Though we got some more shit to fix. We got some more shit to fix. We got some more shit to fix, man. I ain't done yet. Hold up, let me park so I can focus. I gotta think I have to park. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm whipping the spaceship with one hand. Whoop. Wow, there we go. We gooch, we gooch. What else we gotta fix? Uh, get the all field booming. How you get the all field booming, though? How we gonna get the all field booming? Rock the boat. I don't give a damn flow. I don't know. Okay. 
you say baby daddies put put the baby daddies in jail having multiple kids and not taking care of them yeah you gonna have to take care of your kids you gonna have to spend time with your kids but you ain't you know i'm trying to end the baby daddy shit my neighbor always be coming to me and talk to me what's up appreciate that boss all right i'll see you later boss all right they be talking about y'all. I be like, God damn, buddy. But yeah, baby daddies. Yeah, now nah, you gotta take care of your kids. Really, we gonna end even having baby daddies. It's gonna you gonna be in. You gonna be. It's gonna be families. We gonna bring families back. Families gonna stay together because it ain't gonna be the government breaking up families. You know what I'm saying? Families gonna stay together because it's gonna be polygamy. It's gonna be all that. You know so. Everybody gonna be good. It ain't gonna be no fights over. Oh, you ain't get this. All right, you gotta take care of it. You ain't got no money, player. Okay, cool. You gotta, you gotta take a, you gotta take the son and take him with you then. You know what I'm saying? If it just end like that, murder rate is not gonna be high. It is not gonna be. It's gonna be no crime out here. How am I gonna fix the crime? Let me see how I can fix the crime. Everybody gonna have a job. I'm gonna fix the crime because I'm legalizing drugs, first of all. That's how you fix crime. Probably 90% of the, the, the problems is black men don't have opportunities in the hood. Let me tell you how I'm finna fix crime, and that's why I just told y'all, right? Okay. So this is how you fix the hood, all right? It ain't a lot of, it's a lot of broken families in the hood because of slavery. It had a sit back, start from nothing after white people already had a head start getting land, getting money, figuring out what they're going to do. We ain't, we all, most black people in the hood are born into nothing. It ain't no granddaddy gave us this, granddaddy left us this, everybody is born into nothing. So to fix it, you have to give opportunity to the hood. I will make the hood more self substantial if that's a word or not. I don't know. I ain't go to college, but I did go to college, but yeah. So I will legalize weed. So you can have you can sell drugs in your neighborhood. You can sell weed in your neighborhood. You just need to have a store. You can if you from that neighborhood that's y'all corner store. Ain't nobody from the other side of town finna come on this motherfucker. The the neighborhood is gonna eat out for the neighborhood. That grocery store in that neighborhood is gonna be people who work in that neighbor from that neighborhood. Um, working in that uh, neighborhood. The uh, stores, all the jobs around the neighborhood is gonna be for the neighborhood. It's not gonna be nobody from the other side of town or nowhere else taking those opportunities. That's how we gonna make sure everybody is good you feel me so all the different services will you will be the job opportunities around you 